You're watching Action News Now. Storm Tracker weather coverage you can count on. Warm over to Hama County and some clouds around the mountaintops there, but still plenty of snow on the ground, Jason. Yeah, it's going to take a while to melt it, but it definitely will be melting a lot faster going forward. Now, today was about as seasonable as we are going to be in Northern California for quite some time. The last several days, pretty much the entire month of May thus far, we've been cooler than average. But today, we got right back to the Goldilocks area. We had lows this morning in the valley in the lower to mid-50s. Still had some chilly 30s for the mountains and the foothills, but we also warmed up today. 81 degrees in Redding, just one degree warmer than average. It was 82 this afternoon in Red Bluff. We just top it off at 83 degrees in Corning. Oroville was not 59, still having problems with that weather station at the Oroville Airport, but it was a very warm day and it was 79 degrees in Chico, but very few clouds all over the region and we're going to keep it that way overnight tonight. A couple clouds here and there, no good chances for showers. We're going to have a mostly clear beginning to Friday and then we'll have even more sunshine by Friday afternoon and it's going to start heating up. That's when that ridge really begins to get stronger. Saturday, probably not a cloud to be seen anywhere. That's going to be the peak heating for us as we head into the next seven days and then as I've been mentioning all week, Week, we're going to have a small disturbance moving our direction from a different direction than we're used to. It's going to retrogress toward us from east to west. We'll have an increase in clouds on Mother's Day Sunday. Slight chance for showers over the mountains, but again, not much rain is going to fall. It will cool us down a little bit, kicking us back from the brink of triple digits on Saturday, getting us closer to maybe 10 degrees above average. As we move into Wednesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, that ridge will still be in control of our weather, expecting a mostly sunny to sunny sky for those four days also, and we are going to stay well above average. Now, I want to show you one of our seven-day future casts for the amounts of precipitation we're expecting, stopping at first Sunday night. You can see a couple places getting a few hundreds of an inch of rain, but that may be generous. Many places may not even get a trace, and then going forward all the way through Thursday, not adding anything to it because we're still going to have that ridge overhead. And as far as the wind is concerned, not much tonight or tomorrow. We'll have some light breezes coming out of the north on Friday, but then Saturday we're going to have a little bit stronger breeze blowing right down the valley. That's going to help enhance the heat, so it's going to be a sunnier as well as hotter and breezier day on Saturday. Probably don't want to do any burning, but we don't have any extreme fire danger just yet, but we do have a heat advisory out for western Siskiyou County. That goes from noon Saturday until 11 o'clock Sunday. Now it's going to be hot for everyone, but currently Currently, we only have that heat advisor, so keep that in mind. Do what you can during the earlier part of the day. Drink plenty of water because it is still the middle of spring. We're not usually used to heat this intense just yet, but you can see if you want to get some running in tomorrow, good time to do it is the first half of the day. It's going to get a little bit toasty by the afternoon hours. Temperatures back in the lower 90s for the first time in a couple weeks, but we have more heat going forward. So here's your forecast for tonight. 30s and 40s for the higher terrain. Comfortably cool, but it is going to start getting warmer, mainly mid to upper 50s for the valley. Highs a lot hotter tomorrow. Upper 70s and lower 80s for the higher terrain. Upper 80s and lower 90s for the valley. Next seven days in Chico. We're going to have more clouds on Mother's Day with a slight chance for mountain showers. Highs staying in the 90s, but Chico's high of 97 will be the hottest on Saturday. Redding is going to get to 98 on Saturday every other day between 90 and 95 with more clouds on Sunday than any other day, but we'll still have a lot more heat than chances for rain. All right. Thanks so much, Jason.